So in narrative writing today, you have a writing prompt titled $100 Find. You are going to write a story about finding a $100 bill in a parking lot. The following questions may help you think about your story and how to plan your writing. Where were you going when you found the money? What did you do when you found it? Did you decide to keep it, find the owner, turn it in, and why? Who was with you when you found, when you found it? What did the person or people say you should do with the money? How did you feel about your decision and why? Now write your story describing finding a $100 bill in a parking lot. Your story should include the events in the order they occurred. The second part of your um, of the narrative writing piece lets you know it's your rubric and this is ACT Aspire. Um, it lets you know if you want to get all fives in each of these categories, it lets you know what you need to do to achieve a five, a four, a three, a two and a one. Hopefully no one chooses to write at a one. Then the next part is your story plan. This is your title. This is the author, which is you. Characters, who's gonna be the characters in your story? Well, it has to be you and who else is with you? Setting, where did you find it? That would be your setting. Now, entertaining beginnings. Give your reader a hook, then start your story by introducing the characters and setting. We have talked about this in their writing all school here, and um, I know that you can do that. After you have the entertaining beginning, you begin to add elaborative details. You give the reader an introduction, the characters and the setting. You give more elaborate detail about the characters. You explain who they are at the setting, give more details about the setting and get more elaborate about it. The middle paragraph is building anticipation leading up to the main event. So remember, we go on this hill and we go up and we get to the top where the main event happens and then we go down. We end the paragraph. So in this next section, you'll end the paragraph, the action leading to the solution of the problem or con conclusion of the event. That would be, did you decide to keep it? How did you feel? And then wrap it up, conclusion sentence, expressing how you felt about the experience. Now, if you will remember, once you get your um, paragraphs typed into each of these boxes, you have your story written. You just have to copy and paste. Remember, you highlight just the words, not the box. Control C on your Chromebook. And then you come down here and you control V to paste your story. Once you have done that, you may turn it in. This is your writing assignment for Thursday and Friday. So on Friday, you won't have a new writing assignment. This will be the same assignment. So take your time and make it a really good writing piece for me. I am looking forward to reading what you wrote and how you felt whenever you found a $100 bill.